damn it! I had to watch my video again to see if I can figure out where I left off and see if I was actually coherent. And I found there's some breaks in the in in, in the way I've gone along. But uh, yeah, okay. The uh, uh, accumulation uh, per capita of capital seems to be one of the things that help the whole country to grow so fast in such a short a short amount of time. Um, and the development of institutions that uh, tend to become self-serving after a, a short time, uh, and short time can be relative sort of thing, but uh, either way the institutions end up developing in such a fashion that they end up creating these problems. But if you have at the beginning this enormous tax on these people that have, to, prevent, to prevent or reduce the amount of inheritance that passed on to the next generation, then you still have the issue of the person accumulating the wealth up to that point before they die and when they die then that gets taxed away let's say but before they die they still have all that money that's more than what Joe Blow has and it's still a problem so at that point if you if you're looking at it now and saying this much money is the problem then if you reduce it back to the point where the per before the person dies this is the amount of money that he's manipulated and has created and he has that power and capacity to manipulate the system then you still have a problem don't you because he has more money than somebody else so shouldn't you make sure that he doesn't make more than anybody else so he doesn't have more power over anybody else to manipulate the system but should we just let everybody manipulate the system so everybody could equally manipulate the system to make it corrupt <laughs> <laughs> no, I I really have a problem with the idea that it's x the the the, the difference the ratio of difference between the amount of money because the feudal system, if I'm not mistaken, is something different than just the accumulation of wealth in certain hands. There's also certain kinds of systematic regulations and the way the structure of the overall. Um, authority let's call it the structure of the authority I think is more the problem again the institution so I really do think we have to examine our institutions carefully and try to figure out what is it we're doing that allows these manipulations sometimes they're not always necessarily intended to be negative but they do end up having negative effects because we don't realize what it is that we're doing the consequences of this little bit of help and that little bit of help let me give you a little bit of an example I'm a truck driver you know that oh, if you don't it doesn't matter I am a truck driver I'm out on the road and one of the things that I see uh, is that there are a lot of truck drivers out there who and I've, I, I th this is this is a newer generation of truck drivers only it started in 2003 and there were people I've, I've gotten to know who have been around long before that and they've seen a gradual change in the system and the way it's run and the way it works and there was a time when people used to be out there on the road with the big rigs and they were concerned and interested in what they were doing how they were doing it and to try to do it well there were of course there were the assholes of course the assholes are the ones that cause problems because they go and do some shitty thing and because the cowardice of the system the political system we have in there is it doesn't go after the individual instead it throws out a blanket statement and I see that happen often it throws out a blanket statement to say all of them are a problem so we're gonna make a law to stop all of them from doing this meanwhile the guys who took pride in keeping from doing these stupid things, like not maintaining their equipment or making sure the load was secure, whatever the case may be, then those people have lost their pride. Sorry. It bugs me. Ah, uh, okay, let me... So it hurts. It hurts the system and there's a blowback for that and the blowback would be something along the lines of nobody cares anymore then you need more laws which they don't enforce again I'm sorry I 
I do have emotions, and sometimes I try to, uh, they come out a little bit more than I expect them to. Um, but this sort of thing is something that's inherent with a lot of institutions. We've got to fix this problem, and they do it in a way that is not really constructive and is not really helpful. It takes away the individual's ability to do things. It seems more and more we do this. The bigger the system gets, the more we want to automate it. The more we want to say, you have to behave this way. We don't want any pride or anything involved in it. You have to behave this way. So this is one of the things that I think, and it seems so small, you know, like, why shouldn't we have these guarantees? Guarantees, damn it, guarantees. Guarantees of what? You aren't guaranteed to be alive, excuse me. This is not something you can guarantee. I'm going to die. Nobody can guarantee that I'm not going to die. Nobody can guarantee that I'm going to have a job tomorrow. They can tell me they're going to guarantee it. The government come up. I mean, this is another thing. The government gives these guarantees about the amount of money you have in the bank. That's going to be. We're going to cover all this stuff. Next thing you know, the whole system collapses because of the bubbles they create, and they don't have any more money left because they have to pay it out all to these people that guaranteed their money to. Ugh, it, it's it's such a tangled mess. And, you know, I was only talking about a little piece of it before, but it is such an interwoven, tangled mess. And it has, there's, there's far more to it than just this idea of, of accumulated wealth. It's accumulated effects. It's a lot of accumulated effects. And I think a lot of it has to do with the way they've taken the humanity out of humans and turned it into a machine. I, I'm curious to see what your thoughts are on this from this point here. Uh, if you have any questions about anything, please ask me. I'm not necessarily always that clear. I, 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 like I say, this is trying to do this spontaneously. I don't like to do scripted stuff that much. And sometimes it's to my detriment.